the question was what do we do with triple it will it be another institution with students doing coming taking some standard courses and going away or do we have some mission here the the mission that guided us in the beginning was that we want to build a group of people we want to pass out students who are more than those looking for a job and it is a good discipline well paying discipline yes they'll get good salaries but the question is are we going to turn them into problem solvers so this idea of not looking for problems but problems will look for you and then once you have those problems you have so many to choose from you just pick the ones that you like the most maybe the problem that your mother suffered from maybe there were maybe your cousin had a business maybe your uncle was a farmer maybe your masi is a tailor what it bothers them on a day to day basis maybe you took a bike to your school and there were ditches all over and the water was all over them so what is it that really touches your heart can you do something about this through your it so anyway the idea is that we thought that we want to essentially grow it equipped more or less social activist reformers people with a zeal to do something about the society and yes in the process they will get a car a house and get married and everything but let there be something more one of the things that we were clear about is that research is going to be the center of gravity of everything that research is going to decide what is it that this institute is going to do by way of realizing that that fundamental goal so the idea was to build small little communities at triple it centers of excellence each devoted to these things and since these are problems our institute is triple it it based it oriented we said in addition to doing centers of excellence in disciplines of it itself sub disciplines of it itself we will also do a cross marrying of it with different problems areas um it in x in other words we essentially started to form centers of excellence where the centers were doing applying computing it to some problem so this was uh, an example this is an example of how the idea of turning out students who can solve problems who are well versed in problem solving in some areas showed up in the structure of the institute so we were not going to have this department that department that department what we are going to have is communities that are devoted to solving problems using it in whatever area because the fundamental thing is it is not a goal by itself only it is actually a an enabler so we decided what we are going to enable in the beginning so this is one thing that we started with second thing was how do we do this without i mean how do we get the faculty of this kind so most of my time a huge amount of my time went into bringing in the first set of faculty members remember that when you go from 0 to 1 you have gone up by infinity percent 1 over 0 is infinity from 1 to 2 you have gone 50% or 100% so as more and more people come the incremental effect of the next person is that much smaller there is a culture being built so in the beginning it's absolutely critical to make sure that whoever comes here considers this to be their mission their passion their um family job so we should have a sense of togetherness and sense of collective mission so the faculty hiring in the beginning was just absolutely critical absolutely critical so we devoted a huge amount of time going after people working with them for several days before deciding we are going to get married or not anyway so that was the second main thing which i thought was critical absolutely critical um in the meantime we also had to get some bureaucracy out of the way we had to get deemed university status which means uh, um all kind of you know uh, formalities to be completed the students had to be also exposed to this thinking of how we are going to go about this uh the students were very positive although i must say that the students came in thinking another institute like any others like their colleagues went to and there the students thought there is the management and there is the students so the day i heard that word management and students 
I felt like crying. What is this? We are talking about a family here, not about tu or me. And so we started to work on the students. And it didn't take very long because you just have to dig one millimeter deep. They're all soft. It is, it's the surroundings, almost the peer expectations that make them appear tough. Anyway, so the students began to join the thinking. And over time, it, it did change everybody's thinking. And, and we have continued this. After I left, the tradition has continued in the sense that we have been focusing on their uh, human side uh, in addition to the engineer side. It's been really wonderful to see IIIT go from non-existence to the top third, top three in the country. The students who come out of here have a little bit of a, 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 a different way of thinking. Okay, we hope we will increase the presence of that difference even higher. But I think IIIT is uh, now certainly a unique place, well known in the world. And uh, I'm confident that um, uh, that with the, with the, the with, with the work that Rajiv has done and uh, PGN is continuing to do, and the different directions that we are headed in, are all unified by the one single goal of producing well-rounded citizens who are good at IT but also want to do something. So I have high hopes and a lot of confidence that Triple IT would be go, go even further, but more importantly, go further not in classical measures but in measures that we decided we are going to use to measure our own, to gauge our own success.